Crafty Nanny here. Um, just going on a little adventure and we saw a sign that said Clevedon Craft Centre. So we thought we'd come and check it out. So here we have some beautiful grandmother's bonnets with a lovely stream full of ducks. The smell of new, gr new mown grass is very pervasive. There's beautiful yellow flag irises all along the bank there. Really lovely. Queen Anne's lace. And here, presumably, is a little craft centre. She steps down here, look, wild strawberries growing. Wild strawberries. Trying to remember the name of this stuff. Sweet William, it's the other stuff. Always smells so beautiful. Wallflowers. Wallflowers, that's what they are. And forget me nots. Took me a while for my brain to remember the name of wallflowers, but we got there in the end. Beautiful silver smith work. Surprising, yeah, sorry. For now I am, yeah. yeah. Just for now. Thanks. That's a very beautiful piece there, the aquamarine, the brooch. It's very, very pretty. Amethyst, always a favourite of mine. Yeah, so lots and lots and lots of pretty things. I'm not going to film them all because most of the time you can't even see them, but it just gives you an idea that this gentleman has got some real talent. Some real talent. I love this piece with the opal lines going through the stone. I don't even know if you can see it. Yes, just like that beautiful lit up bits of opal in the stone. Anyway, so yes, this is all his work and he's obviously got his little studio in there. Do -do. Been here a long time. Look at all these. It's so cute. So sweet. Look at this. Charming. Look at these gorgeous little plates with the egg, cu egg cups in the middle so you can have your um, eggies and soldiers. Absolutely delightful. Oh, box full of cats, little cats. <sighs> oh, little forget me nots. They. So a lovely flavour to it. Um, you use this for cooking. I think quite often it's used with lamb as well. Bay is actually quite nice with chicken too. And this is the um, teaching workshop. So we're going to go and have a look in here in a minute. That's fun. <laughs> All sorts. Wax. Um, so it's a full-on day. It's yeah. kind of about ten or twelve. Uh, yeah. Pretty good fun. Um, one in, so there's one hand-painted furniture. Let's see what this is doing. So we've got fifth of June. The then pants. the next full day one's the tenth of July. Okay. Then the twenty-eighth of August. Then there's the two this other cool. ones. But if you're wanting to kind of quite like the um, zebra. Well. Um, two spaces left from the fifth, which is next to Sunset. Um, yeah. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Lots of courses being discussed here, so you can come and do courses here. Really cool. It's all on the website, and you can book.
so the chap that we just saw next door is went to the same school as my children and lives in the same town that we used to we used to live in the same town that we used to live in um, and he's doing most beautiful stuff and workshops here uh, wow some really good stuff next door to him is a wood turning place um, this is something I would always fancy trying but obviously you need all the proper equipment and so he's got all these logs here waiting to be turned and then he's making them into beautiful things but he's not there today so we can't go and chat to him so uh, we'll carry on with our exploration there's a lady here making frames for her paintings hello hi there come in. we like to come in that's all right okay. show them good stuff and make them feel inspired <laughs> Hidden away in the hedge. Look at this, lots more studios. Got my car. Hi there. Good afternoon. Good, Good afternoon, we will. Oh, look at this. So much talent in this area. Look at this mermaid. She's absolutely amazing. You know I love a good mermaid. Bit of mucker to make your heart warm. Gorilla. All tooled out of big sheets of leather. The smell in here is amazing. It smells like a fine Rolls Royce. Saddles are amazing and this is the gentleman here, you see? True craftsman. So this one has mosaics and I'm just thinking these are little tiny mini mosaics that you do with kits. So he has all the kits here that you can come and buy, all different sizes. They're not quite the same as Diamond Art in the sense that each one's a little tiny flat coloured square. Um, it's some amazing pieces here. These are just to show you what the kits do. So they're all made up of multiples of these pieces of pegboard here. Right, and then you peg them in. Action! Da, 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 da. So uh, basically then you have a something very similar to a crosses pattern in that each one of those symbols there represents colour. The key being there. So I'm on these four colours at the moment. So I'm doing the cross. So that's colour 479. So you put that over the top. Take your pixel square, you've got the number just there, a pair of tweezers, and pop it in. And then push it in. And it actually pegs into the background, yeah. so it's not just stuck on, it's actually yeah. pegged in. So you've got little holes on the back of those. Oh, look at that. Pretty damn cool. And those. such a huge variety of choices. So many new ideas for things you can do to keep yourself out of mischief whilst you're shut down in COVID. You need to come out here, get yourself a kit, and keep yourself busy for weeks and weeks. Beautiful hair, tiger, there is, all yeah. sorts. Lovely little birds. Oh, yeah, Aren't these delightful? Yes, so Thank you. Absolutely right, delightful. Bye. Puffins. I know some of my students were heavily into the buffin puffins. Hello.
little laughing dog there hiding in the greenery <laughs> we're gonna go and have a nice cup of tea now in the tea rooms so that's going to be our next stop so we're now at Dot's traditional tea room um, or tea cafe and we're in the garden and there's lots of people here all having their cream teas and so I thought I would have a traditional cream tea. You can see the pottery's just over there, all the clay spattered up on the window, that's rather cool and um, this is the little cafe behind us here so we'll just wait and see how our clotted cream tea comes, we're going to make you very jealous. There you go, look, proper cream tea, ooh yummy yummy yummy, carrot cake, scones, jam, tea and hot chocolate. Delicious. Okay,